back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. We back, baby. Hoods and News Show. Was it season two? I guess we could just call it season two now, season right? Two. We just called it season two. I knew you was going through some burnt out shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That, that's, that, that, was, that was new, though. You know what I'm saying? I ain't do none of this. I ain't. Yeah. Man, I, I, it I, was I, like. Kept it real chill. Yeah, it, was, it was chill. It was all right, though. I, 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 I give you. Hey, hey, hey. Come on, man. C, hey, look, C, C plus. C. 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 I take it. I take C plus. All right. That was all right, though. But now, nah, though, it's your boy, Dave B. Hudson News, and this is the Hudson News Show. Yes, the whole team in here. Forget what y'all be saying in the comments and all the rumors and the speculations and stuff. <laughs> Everybody here is good. You know what I'm saying? So let's give a clarification what happened and why we haven't been here. One, we all busy as fuck. You know what I'm saying? Two, if y'all don't know, I got sick. I caught COVID-19. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to address this right here. I think he said three times. Like I caught it one time. Caught one time. Go, go, go. You know what I'm saying? I called it. You know what I'm saying? I was in quarantine for two weeks and I was in recovery for like a month and a half. I ain't gonna lie. You know what I'm saying? That man had the regular cold. <laughs> yeah. But now, nah, hey, everybody, see, I ain't, I ain't gonna be all big super because you can catch that joint. We, you can catch that joint anyway. You can catch that joint coming in your house. You know what I'm saying? Opening your door. You know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna tell everybody to take precautions. So, you know, I ain't gonna be big super. You know what I'm saying? But I'm gonna tell everybody to take precautions. You know, keep a mask when y'all in public, you know, places and, you know what I'm saying, try to social distance as best as you can and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? All serious and stuff. You know what I'm saying? But, what we got right here? Malcolm X. Yeah. Malcolm X, a.k.a. Elway. Elway. Did you already know you can't mute nothing without? Big Southeast. You know what I'm saying? He said Big Southeast. Yeah. Big Southeast. Yeah. Don't mute Domo, man. Don't mute Domo. That's oh, Big Northeast. Mr. Bro. Uh -huh. CEO, CEO Domo Ro. I like the sound of that. Coach CEO Ro. Domo Row. You know what I'm saying? That shit, it got, if you was a, hey, bro, right? bro, if you was a rapper, that would be my name. What's that? You was CEO Domo Row. Nah, that's corny. Nah, that, that shit like, like a lit name. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, that's a lit ass name. Because everybody just gonna call you the CEO. It's no rapper. The CEO. Name, CEO, <laughs> like, CEO Domo Row. Say they the balls, you know, that'll be lit. Somebody gonna steal that watch. Yeah, I love it. Somebody still. They gonna get his hoods in them. It's me a CEO rapper. Yep, trying yeah. to pay for promo. <laughs> <laughs> no bull. And then also we got big model. Big yeah. lips. That... <laughs> Lip gloss poppers. Big lashes. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was just the big lashes for me. Oh man, so you know, y'all already know who I'm is. So don't, don't worry about me. But we're gonna get straight to the discussions, man. So what's gonna be the first discussion, y'all? Let's talk about Aunt Lizzie Ooh, and Big TV. I'm talking about the trending topic of the DMV, other place. I'm like, like I'm talking about everybody. Like I'm talking about this man made number one trending on Twitter. Like, yeah, is that real? <laughs> Let's talk about it, man. So we go. I, we, I wanted to be able to say whatever, cause I don't want nobody. To, the people that he bid off, please don't be in your feelings and take it personal. We only speaking about what happened. I didn't make you the bid. I didn't bid off you. Personal feelings aside, some people cool with me. I'm cool with y'all. I don't have no issue with y'all. We just talking about what's been going on. Now, before we get deep, let's talk about the surface value. I think it's genius. Like that's marketing genius, cause he's not doing nothing different than what other people are already doing. Like I don't want to compare him to a. Uh, the rainbow head dude because something ain't right but I'm saying like the concept of trolling you know what I'm saying and, and bidding all people we don't call it trolling we call it bid so bidding all people here and nothing really happened behind it like nobody really got hurt or nothing like that now I feel like some things went too personal on everybody's side yeah once you start posting family members and talking about people kids that's a whole number I'm not getting into none of that but it was done we seen it you know what I'm saying I'm not here to say who right or wrong whatever but Listen, when he go live, the people tune in. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, I just feel like I just seen family members in his live. I'm like, I go live and they don't even join my live. Man, man, glissy live. <laughs> so I mean, it's, it's up there. Like he he turned it into streams and revenue. He turned that into to the point he got he got his own show coming. He's got his own podcast. He politicking with a weed strand. His uh -huh. own weed. His own weed. Him, no Savage, and Davey, the only three people that I know. Well, no, that's a lot, because Nintendo, me. Big Nintendo, yeah. and Shy yeah, Guy have yeah. OG. So it's a few people here now, so let me take that back. And some people that might not know, so I ain't yeah. say you and I ain't personal. I'm just not thinking of yeah. off the top of my head. But, I mean, he running his play. He was up in New York. You know what I'm saying? Shoot, he dropping videos, like, 
every week. Got song why I'm no feast. Mm. Uh, seen it with flop. He, he made himself relevant. Yeah. He went from being he went from being the big to making people the big. Yeah. Right. Because that's let's keep it real. Two months ago, who was who was talking about put that Aunt Lizzie on? Yeah. That's a fact. So I think I think the thing, but the thing about him, he always really been bidding. If you go on this live, but it's just like lately, it's just been it's another level now. It's another level. So it's like my thing was I already saw that. You know, like I'm like, bro, and he a, he a great artist, but I'm telling you, his 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 natural gift is to entertain people. Like he's a good, like a great entertainer. All right, some people are just entertainers. Entertainment. He's just a great entertainer, and I was just like, damn, you know what I'm saying? And I've been saying that. I'm like, man, I was like, bro, I should get his own podcast, bro, I should do something. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, damn, you know what I'm saying? He'd be on some gilly shit. You know what I'm saying? Something like that. That's how I was like, <laughs> said that. Oh yeah, he did just bit off, bit off gilly. Like, God damn, like. Yeah, he said he was gonna slap you too. Did you get slapped? Huh? You can hide you hit. I pleaded fifth. Right. I pleaded fifth. I pleaded I'll fifth. take that. I pleaded fifth. <laughs> he did say he was gonna slap me though. He did. I ain't lying. You look good though. Damn, damn. Nah. You look like you, you know, you <laughs> look in good condition right now. Shout out to Lizzy though, man. I pleaded fifth on that. But yeah. How y'all feel about Big TV? Y'all been telling them? I already know Giselle been telling me. <laughs> How you know I've been telling I see her in every single one. <laughs> <laughs> it's the year of the ants. He did it. Any if your name ant is your year. Like he's the year of the ants. Like if your name ant, you matter. And that's just period. Like, but no, like, he's the king of that shit right now. <laughs> like it's no missing no live. Like if he live to five in the morning, I'm live to five in the morning because it's that funny. Like he's that funny. Like he not even he be being dead serious. That's the funny part. Like he don't be joking. Like he's dead serious though. And like it's like the what gets me is like once you fuck with him, like it's like all your information is for us. Like he it's like he go like he go find shit. You ain't even know you had. Like, Damn, you know? y'all remember Axe Jeeves? That was Axe. Oh, hello. No. You said no, Axe. Like, 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 you Axe Jeeves. You Axe Axe. You gonna find me out. Listen, yeah. What's y'all? Uh, Nawa. And and like Nawa, I just be pulling people info out the cut, y'all. Oh, Nawa, Nawa, he be, he be on YouTube. Everything about like, everything. Remember the joint he did with Rico Nasty and pulling up old with like old shit, old, stuff, old shit that you know stuff that. How you like know this, bro? Yeah, I mean, it showed me something, man. Yeah. The DMV showed me something, man. I'm glad. Hey, I, I shout out to all my loved ones and friends, my real friends, for keeping my secrets. I don't really got no skeletons in my closet, but I appreciate y'all. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah. if I ever end up the bid, I know I ain't got to worry about it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, it ain't going to be nothing too crazy. It might be something you can ha ha he he, but it ain't going to be like. Right. Oh, he need an ad. <laughs> ad on the bottom of his Instagram lives that say, don't try this at home, though. Yeah, Because it's going to be some youngers who ain't as known as him. Yeah. It's going to be somebody who, who just some young dude that they just about to be saying whatever they want on Instagram yeah. live, and nah. they're going to get punished. Yeah, facts. You got it. It's an art to it. It ain't like he running around. Nah, he knows. So. Yeah. He, he doing, he doing it right. Yeah, he pepped so. it for the he every he's capitalizing off every opportunity. Can't be no nobody. You know man. I I just I Don't wish everybody that. success. You know what I'm saying? And if you end up being a bid, just take it. Cause one thing that we seen, like if he had OnlyFans just to go live on the bid, like I would subscribe. That is the OnlyFans that I will subscribe to. Like too bad you can't go live on OnlyFans. Yes, you can. You can. Oh, you can. Yes. Oh, you can. That's what Boosie should have did, but they took his. Yes, you can. I think he got live on OnlyFans. No, but I know you can go live on OnlyFans. Oh, his, his I know people on OnlyFans. Lit, though. Yeah, and you won't be shit. saying to girls like, "I'm about to go live on OnlyFans." Like it's uh, like a whole yeah, little journey. Really you can go. That, like, yeah. yeah. I mean, we what I tell you about OnlyFans? What I tell y'all about OnlyFans? Shout out to all the girls that got OnlyFans though. I ain't knocking it. Run y'all bag up. Get your money. What you say? He crushing Shelly. Shelly. What's her name? Shelly. <laughs> Shelly. Shelly. <laughs> he crushing. She eating too though. Like everybody. Listen, hold on. First of all, Spank this is. This, let's be real, right? Because he makes her the bid, right? He bid off her room. He bid off. Now we watching her upgrade because we watched the apartment go from no furniture. To, to like, furniture. It's like a brand that photo compartment. <laughs> and she's still like, added shit to that and joke. Every ad did. What? She added it. He like, just bid it, though. What? I did it. Everybody, hey, nah, for real, though. 
Yeah, he's spanking on the low. I ain't spanking yeah. Shelly. I like you. I like you. Just being funny. Shout out to Shelly. We just having fun, but I'm yeah. just saying, like, Bro, but it's crazy we gotta say that now. Her apartment really is because people sensitive, and I'm not saying she's. But it's I'm crazy though, because you cannot. Grow, look, you cannot grow up. The, the most popular people out of elementary school were the ugly kids because they were funny. You cannot grow up in D.C. or P.G. Jump, not not have tough skin, not yeah, Joan, though. So, yeah, yeah. you know, we older now, so people take but it a little some bit shit, more, But some people got some shit personal for Yeah, me. I got all I, the Jones. I, I ain't speaking about the personal stuff, from skinny, but like... Mm -hmm. I'm talking about skinny, skinny to fat. So I got all the... I got the oh, skinny man. jokes. They cook me when I was skinny. When I got fat. I've been the same. I, I got right. the fat I got the braces. <laughs> so, you know what I'm saying? I was like, that's why I don't say that. That's why when people bid on me on my lives and shit, I don't, I don't, I got, they don't phase me. I got teased and picked on that's and all that shit. That's what I give bro. No I don't, that shit. You got, you got tough skin. I got sometimes. tough skin for all that shit. That's you just get too laugh. emotional with certain things and go live and then it'd be like you crying and I'd be wanting to just. You know what I'm saying? Hack your you account. Crying like a mug. My last rant, I wasn't even crying. Like, you can but see my eyes. You know what we mean when we say you crying, bro. You Ranting. sound crazy. Ranting. We won't leave that alone, man. We won't leave that alone. No, leave. you need to leave that alone. We won't leave that alone. <laughs> I only done it twice. I ain't do it no other time. The other one, I think you really would. When you was in the dock. Nah. Bro, I, I got a lot of phone calls about you that time. They was real worried about you. The fuck they thought I was going to do? funny, huh? But hold on, speaking of Dr. Big TV, look, one thing that just happened, this the, the corona, this pandemic, quarantine and all that, it made a shift. Like it was like a parallel universe. Like you're not So people. all the comedians is started rapping and then all the rappers like turned into comedians. comedians. But you know how like at first everybody was like this 2020, like my, this this COVID lockdown shit has been the best. Like Bro, it's been so entertaining. The, first the time, whole bro. thing, just watching the, year the scammers, scammers the year ants, the year of the scammers, <laughs> the year of it all. Like this is yeah, just like everything that happened. It started. It really started right before it started, beginning of the year. At that Facts. all the way to the end. I want to know. It got bad. It got. It went from like remember everybody was like twenty twenty vision. Yeah, like, like and then. It shifted like everything got dark when we first right. like locked down for real. Yeah. But then everybody stopped making the way. We started like, zoo bottles everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> Bells, houses, cookouts. Like it was lit. The summer. Everybody was, lit. was smoking ninety three pressure straight from Cali. Everybody now had everybody Cali. in the house is still entertaining. Like. Yeah. Yeah. 2020 put the best out of some people. It definitely. If you survive 2020, you deserve like they should just automatically give you a million dollars. Definitely. For just been surviving 2020 because this show been spanking some people. Yeah. yeah. I ain't gonna hold you. Yeah. Oh man. The president man. allegedly caught the Rona. Allegedly. Yeah, because he bounced back. He like he was Superman. He said, they said he had the I Superman feel good. shirt I got on this. I the vaccine and I'm great. I took Regeneron. <laughs> Regeneron. The Regeneron. He was like, <laughs> man, I'm great. and I caught that shit. They gave me two Tylenol pills and told me to go home and quarantine. Yikes. Two Tylenol. They gave me two Tylenol pills. Oh, that's my you. Thank you. Thank you. Of course, I had DC government insurance. They weren't going. <laughs> like, and I did the George Washington. That's that's where they sent everybody. Yeah. Speaking <laughs> of scammer, shout out McKen. McKen dropped probably the funniest parody song. He did it for the scam now, scam later. I need to the Drake that jump. Oh. Bro, that jump fire, man. It gotta go. Yeah, it gotta go. He is hilarious. Man. Man. Instead of saying "baby," he said "janky." <laughs> you like? You know, hold on. When we take a break, I'm gonna show you that joke. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got it. Hold on, hold on. I got it. Hey, we you calling the show? Just go ahead. Put the phone down. Go ahead, big boy. He ready to go on. He ready to go on his break. But anyway, second discussion. Sean Cotton and Say Cheese TV. They brought it. They said they had a top 10 list of the most beautiful women in the whole entire United States of America. Show sure now. And they put DC as number two. I'm sure gonna, did. I'm going to put the... Let me let me go to the whole list right here. I didn't even see it. Where the list at? Where the list at? Houston was number one. He put Houston as number one. I ain't going to lie. That's a good choice. I've personally never been to Houston. Man, so y'all can comment. Y'all let me know if that's true. Houston got them bad. I feel like we only got bumped to number two because we starting to become gentrified. And they messing up our pretty woman ratio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm keeping it a bang. Because yeah. every person in the industry, like rappers for years, even when I was a kid, they used to come here and do shows. They always said we had some of the most beautiful women. You know what I'm saying? Biggie even rapped about it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, this is a well-known thing throughout, like, people rich. But 
I, yeah, they, but I think, they I think, are I think when they, women but the thing there. about it, I think he was kind of like putting a whole. But see now, when you say you know, like Beyonce come from Houston, no, that's a fact. Oh, Megan from Houston, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right, There's so, a lot of them. From but Houston. see, I don't want nobody to get it confused. Don't just oh, cause she Randy thick. Rucci. I'm gonna say she prettier pretty. than some. You know what I'm saying? But you know, like Randy Rucci now. It's a lot. Who is that? DJ Dougie from Houston. She's from Houston, too. I think. If she's not from Houston, she's from there. I don't know. But she heard her name. Texas. Yeah, light skin. Yeah, she's definitely from Texas, though. She a baddie, too. Asian doll. You know, she be a little ratchet. She's still a pretty brown-skinned girl. I know growing up for me, PG used to be pretty girl. That's that's what I was. When they say DC, I know they putting a whole... Yeah, they putting a whole metropolitan area. Because you saying, oh, when we go to the club, when you go to the club, it be mostly Maryland girls and stuff like that. You know? Just think about how many mobs. We yeah. get that come from here, like video vixens, models, even the actresses, like yeah. um, uh, Taraji from here. Angel, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Angel, yep. yeah. Uh, Uptown, Godfield, Regina. Well, I forgot. I think two, is two, both the Regina's from here. I know one of the Regina's. Yeah, from Regina. Here. Uh, yeah. I forgot her last name. I don't want to say the wrong last name, but and they, they them top actresses and they bad. Like them, them y'all WCWs. Where they I from? Know, right in the, Facts, facts. Back, All right. Back in the '80s, man, they said this was the town where everybody came for the woman. You right? Everybody from New York, bro. All the New York dudes, uh, Alpo had a baby mother down here. Man, he that rat. He came down here and got, we, we get money. Not an issue with baby woman back in the '80s. He was falling in love with them joints, even the little. You know what I'm saying? You fall in love with them giants, man. Yeah, Jones, even even the even the little yeah giants, man. The little yeah, you know what I'm saying? Pass them around, man. You fall in love. He's like, nah, I love these girls in DC. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? But not like, I mean, the list is pretty accurate. Only thing I agree, disagree with that L.A. was number six. And I mean, L.A. got them baddies, though. Baddie what? Like, What's the majority of like, popular? What's the what's out there? And then they, and then they got humor and personality. Come on. As far as looks, as far as looks, I can give D.C. probably in the top three. You know what I'm saying? But humor, three. top three. Number one. Nah, I don't give D.C. number one. Why not? I don't get DC number one. I can't get DC number one. Because it's not listen, just based. Listen, 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 it's, listen. All right, but hold on. I said, I said, but as far as humor and personality for the females, man, we got the most roughest females out here. And what I mean by that, I'm talking, we got the toughest females out, out here. Like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Chicago, New, oh, York. No, New York. I feel like New York, New York is number New York. one. New York is number four. No, I think they number so one. Oh, I'm saying toughest wise. Crazy. The New York women. I don't want no woman that if I try hard there, she be like, yo, dead ass B. You need to, yeah. I love, you, 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 you like I love New York. I went to, when I was in school, bro. It's something about New York. I like the. I like a little. Don't just let me tell you. Nah, oh, talk back a little bit. I like communication. Like I like huh? the New that's York. That's why y'all man. go back and forth like that. You like that, low key? Come on, man. You, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like, I think females. But for real, wise. Y'all want to talk Toxic. See? Female man, wise solid. in DC, man, they just like they, they always try like when you try to holler at them, they act like they trying to fight you or something. Like, what's up? Like you gotta know how to talk back to them, though. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I, I, I'm test. always gonna come back with you. I'm always gonna Not come back with you. But I'm saying, like, if you go down like North Carolina or something, you try to book a little joint. That that was another robbery too. I, I didn't understand why North Carolina wasn't on top ten. But at the same time though, like you go down there, you go down there, you try to go holler at the joint. You know what I'm saying? I remember some years back, I went down Atlanta and tried to holler at the joint, right? She she dissed me, but she dissed me so nice, and she only she she only didn't give me no attention because she was married. She had a married ring. So I'm like, they, she had a married ring. Yeah, I mean, she had a little <laughs> marriage ring or whatever, okay. right? She was married. You know, I'm like, but she was so nice about it. Like she gave me conversation after and all that shit. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But it's like women out here, you be like, hey, how you doing? She's like, boy, get the fuck out my face. And she then no and then if she why. and then if she with your and then when she with her friends, she gonna try a bit on your ass. You know what I'm saying? I ain't never had that shit. You know what I'm saying? Whatever, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like, y'all can bid on you in front of your face with her friends, then what? You know what I'm saying? That's embarrassing, son. You can go on her ass. It's probably as that's why niggas, that's why niggas out here be going on, man, throwing fucking water bottles, like, fucking bitch, like, all that shit. But that ain't no, man, that ain't no, 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 that ain't cool. Nah, that ain't man. Nah, it ain't mad. Yeah, well, but, it, but at the same time, but at the same time. Let a nigga do that to me, a Yeezy will be in his chest. And within Ooh, five that, minutes, is that is that is it is that a subliminal? No, Not that's a that's a promise. If I ever get disrespected by a man like that, a nigga can't even yell in my face. Them Yeezys like that. Though. It don't no matter what I say. Though. No it don't matter what I say to you. Hey, whoever dude who had them Yeezys on, he need to get like a partnership with them. <laughs> <laughs> 
Them jokes like that. Hey, hold on, hold on. We ain't about to do it like that. We ain't about to do it. Nah, them blue jokes like that, though. Everybody really started wearing them for real, too. Nah, was people it? been wearing them. No, they yeah. really was putting them joints on them. They really was they joints on them. Them joints was on World like Star and Earth. Nah, y'all trying to make it seem like, oh, no, nah, we ain't even about to do that, man. We ain't about to do that, man. But nah, like.